Good evening, everyone, and happy Monday. I'm Monica Quintero. We are seeing some chilly conditions out there, but pretty typical this time of year, and also some windy conditions. Let's go ahead and take a live view for you of your West Texas State Bank Cam weather cam. We do have a cold front moving through right now. Let's go ahead and take a look at your current temperatures out there. Right now, we are seeing temperatures in the mid 50s, 56 in Odessa Midland, and right now we're seeing 54 degrees in Alpine. Your satellite radar, you can see some rain cloud cover over in Oklahoma and Arkansas. Our area, however, we're seeing clear skies and no rain right there on the radar. Here's a look at your almanac to give you a perspective of yesterday and today. Not too big of a difference out there. Yesterday, that high was about 60 degrees. Normally, we see about 59 degrees. The low, pretty chilly, though, 29 degrees. Typically, though, we see it about 31 degrees. Now, today, that high, just a few degrees cooler. You can see 57 degrees of that high. Normally, we're at 59 degrees. That low, 35 degrees. Typically, we see it at about 31 degrees. Now, that record set back in 2015 at about 79 degrees. 1948, you can see very chilly temperatures at about 10 degrees there. The winds seem to be a factor lately. You can see not calculating in some areas, but 28 degrees uh, right there. So some gusty wind conditions out there to keep in mind. These were the maximum winds that we saw today. They are going to die down, though, as you can see here as the night progresses. We are getting winds out of the northeast, and typically when we see that, we see dust as well. So you may have seen that out there today. Here are those winds. You can see right now we are seeing some breezy conditions, about 15 miles per hour current Currently in Odessa and Midland, about 18 in Big Ben. Guadalupe Pass, they always see gusty conditions there, but only about 10 miles per hour right there. And Presidio, about 12 miles per hour. As the night progresses, you can see they drop down to the single digits, about 9 in Odessa and Midland. And by tomorrow morning, you can see there very light winds, about 6 miles per hour. Uh, in Odessa and Midland. Here's a look at how your temperatures will shape up. Very chilly conditions. You can see about in the mid-20s, about 8 o'clock. We are going to see that cloud cover. We're going to see more of it as the day progresses. By noon, we're going to see those temperatures in the 40s. And by 4 o'clock, we'll see those temperatures in the upper 40s. Here's a look at your conditions, uh, your temperatures out there. You can see 53 degrees in Odessa Midland, 53 in Big Spring. By about midnight tonight, we're going to see temperatures in the 30s and 40s as well. By Tuesday morning, we're going to see very chilly temperatures ranging from the 20s, 30s, and 40s and by 8 o'clock you're going to need to bundle up as well it will continue to be cold the low tomorrow expected to be about 26 degrees chilly conditions because of that cold front moving through right now here's a look at your headlines below freezing lows a cold front and of course we want to remind you of the four p's anytime it gets below freezing out there here's a look at your temperatures as we zone in on your areas northern basin the lows in the 20s the highs in the 40s and 50s central basin you can see the lows in the 20s and 30s the highs in the 40s and 50s so very cold conditions but pretty typical this time of year trans pecos you can see temperatures in the 30s and the highs in the 50s and 60s the mountains are right there, the temperatures in the 30s and 40s, and the highs in the 40s and 50s, very, very cold. Let's go ahead and take a look at your seven-day forecast. You can see them chilly conditions tomorrow, but they'll continue to warm up. Take a look by Saturday, Sunday, they warm up quite a bit. We do have a small chance of rain in the forecast Friday into Saturday. That's because of a short wave. Basically, you guys, that's energy. So we did put that slight chance of rain Friday into Saturday morning, but 70s in the forecast this time of year? Wow. Can't come soon enough for me. But it's going to get colder tomorrow. It's going to get cold tomorrow. You know, we can. But the wind's going to go down. Right. Right. That's good news. We're on this roller coaster ride as usual. All right, Monica, thank you. Well, Delta Airlines is issuing.